Okay, so here I go. I'm suited up, mainly because I'm a sissy when it comes to flying insects. It doesn't matter how um, actually aggressive they are. Um, this is where the uh, bumblebee nest is. It's right under here. Um, they literally bumble their ways in through the... Um, our previous owners of this house decided to break some windows in our door before they moved out. Um, so anyway, so the bumblebees come in through there, they fly down, they land there, and they climb in. They ask that a lot, and uh, yeah, they just they just don't. Oh, there she goes. Oh, she flew out the window. If she can find her way out, that's the other thing. So uh, they're not very intelligent. Um, oh, there she comes at me. Here's one here. That's a bumblebee. That's what a bee looks like. I really don't want her to sting me because I'd or to sting my glove because I don't want her to die. Um, see, there's like very little aggression. She's just more concerned about what I am and the fact that I just opened up this board. Um, yeah, you're trembling. You just don't know what to do here. See, they're very fuzzy um, compared to my friend the wasp. And the fuzzy is actually what gives them the color as opposed to yellow jackets which their bodies are actually colored so bumblebees are black and their fuzz is yellowish gold or whatever color that is and we got a couple of them out here now don't sting me because I don't want you to die she's trying She's on my veil. She's trying to sting me. Yeah, you're terrifying, says the guy who's wearing the mask. They're just underneath this thing. Kind of interesting. This is just a big swast of material. This whole thing is just rumbling. She's really trying. This will all be going right back. I'm not interested in killing these guys. I mean, it's not going to be too much longer. They're going to be gone anyway, but... Here they are. See, there's little pots. There's a little baby one. Not a, see, it's not organized at all. They're just a little, these little pots with comb in them. Not in comb, like they put larvae in them. It's not very big. It's about the size, I don't know, maybe. Unless there's more here. Maybe there is. Not honeybees, by the way. These are bumblebees. And there's not nearly the numbers of bumblebees as there are, say, yellow jackets or hornets. I like to find some of the honey. Oh, there's a big one. I mean, that's the queen. Come back. Come back. She, she took off. <laughs> now, 
these guys are just flying around. They're not, they're really not super aggressive. I mean, back. She got away. The big one there too. That might be the queen. I like to know how big this is under here without really totally disturbing everything. Looks like they laid paper. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to have it and crush you. Why don't you disappear? Thank you. It's almost like they laid this paper down, or this plastic down. Not a bear, I think that's really it. I mean, there's not really much there. Get out of my ear. Gee. There's a couple of these really big bumblebees, but I don't know what the significance there is. Honey, though. I mean, if I popped open one of these little cells, there would be one in there and that. It feels sticky, like it would, it would be honey in it. Actually, really, that's all there is to it. So I'm just going to go ahead and try to put some of this stuff back. Quite a few big ones over here. That's the kind of bumblebees I really know to see. So they must be older adults. There's another one there. You can see the difference between the bee and say the hornet or the yellow jacket. So I don't know how well this is gonna come out. Um, this is our friend the bumblebee. About as big as my fingernail. Um, and then next to her, right here, is a female yellow jacket. This is a German yellow jacket. And kind of, I mean, that's the difference. That's what you're looking for. When you're saying B. This is what you mean. This is what you have. So, I don't mean to bust bubbles here, but that's uh, this is a bumblebee. She's buzzing, she's not happy. Alright, girlfriend, come on, let's get you out. That was really only for comparison's sake. You sting me and it's curtains, though.